what is going on guys, it is Fusions Gaming here bringing you a Battlefield 4 video. Today this video is not going to be a gameplay, I'm literally just going to show you guys the awesome new update which they have released, I think was two days ago now on the day of this video when I when it comes out. Um, the, video, the update is really, really good. It's probably the best day update I've seen for Battlefield 4. So let's go straight into it. So obviously, it's a new menu. It's a new, it's a new startup screen when you first do it. Well, to me it was. I don't know if it was to you guys, but it might, it might be, it might not be. So as soon as you get to this screen, obviously you click the profile you want. So you press your one. So you press A. It gives you the old welcome to the battlefield. Basically, it's just preparing. There you go, preparing for all-out war. Basically, getting all your stuff ready for you. So once this has done this section, you'll be brought to the actual main menu, which is now. So here we have, it gives you a nice little personal message of Happy Friday, and then your gamer tag. And here we are, is basically the home of the screen so far. So before, it used to be a lot different. It used to literally just be in subtitles on the left-hand side of the screen. With, I think it was like a your community on your right-hand side. But now, as you can see, there is a new layout. So basically, this is your home. So it basically shows you the recent, the recent servers you've played. And this one here is my friend, so I can join, go join my friend's server and join in the action with him. I can go to my recent server, I watch the new trailer, sort of tips for if you're new to Battlefield 4. Tells you the daily events, but if you click on that one, that takes you to the servers to look for like the quick match, join squad to join, test range, blah 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 blah. Which obviously used to be in a different section. So if we go back now to... how do we go back now? Uh, there we are, if we click the RB or LB for your next box, and I think it's... L1 or R1 on, on PS4? I don't know if PS4 haven't got, have got this update, I'm not sure. I'm sure they would have, but obviously I don't have a PS4. So obviously we scroll over to the RB and this is the same thing, so it just brings you to the new section. Press RB again, it comes to the campaign, so if you want to go blast some missions out, you can. And this way it gets to your progress in your Battlefield 4 gameplay, and your, your basically your awards progression through your battle packs, for your guns. So here we have like the stats on the right hand side. Mine's not too bad. Well, okay, to me that's not bad. It's bloody well nice better than my Call of Duty one. So as we go here, we can I think we can click out on soldiers and it gets basically all your soldier progressions of your class. As you can see, I've got all my kits done. I haven't got the vehicles because I don't like vehicles and uh, I've got a few guns to store to go. But yeah, that's that one. So obviously we go down to awards, which I think is dog tags. Yeah, no, uh, it's ribbons, medals, assignments, DLC assignments blah 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 shows you what you've completed which obviously all this used to be in a different category this is your dog tags it obviously says dog tags so i didn't see properly shows you all all of them for you which is absolutely awesome i got quite a few i can't stand it with these yellow thing on i don't know why it's just but i have ocd for this game i don't know why it's even in game when you have like uh new weapons attachments and for some reason in battlefield 4 or in the past battlefield 4 games uh, Battlefield, all the past Battlefield games, they, there's like a weird glitch which basically every time you load on, it comes up and it's absolutely fucking annoying. But ayo. So yeah, there's, there's your dog tags just showing your mind briefly. And obviously, you go to your battle packs when you earn them in the game. So I've got a few. So let's do let's do a few now. So okay, I got some stuff for the uh, which guns that for the L85A2. I've got a gold one for reaching level 75. So obviously at the moment it is double XP weekend. For Battlefield 4, which is absolutely amazing. So hop on and get yourself some ranks, uh, get some new levels. It's a ranking up. So that's that section. And obviously you move over, you go to the stores. You can look for pre-order Battlefield for, uh, 1. Rent a server, become premium, get more battle packs. You get your, like, your kits. You basically, what all, all, all you got there in front of you, but on the left hand side. And obviously you go to more, and you've got the options and your credits. So that is about the update of this video. Got basically the update, and probably going to be the video as well. Uh, also, awfully, ugh, there we go. Also, if you press LB again, you can go down to the game categories. So there's the Battle for 1, Battle for 4, Battlefield Hardline is coming soon. I don't know how, why they haven't done that in the career, because Battlefield 1 isn't, Battlefield 1 isn't released just yet. So I don't know why, why they've put that one there, but obviously they want the money. It's a new game coming up, so it's it's big in, big in the gaming business sort of thing upcoming game so they want it there ready for the game to come out I, i'm really intrigued to see what the career is because i mean it was basically your stats against your friends it'd be awesome or some community challenges i don't know i don't know uh, pff, we will find out hopefully in the in a few weeks or in a few days time so we've got the news so it takes you a lot of sort of the 
uh, the beta for about for one starts on the 31st of, the 31st of August. Guy, I really need to slow down. I do apologize, guys. And obviously, welcome to Battle for Four. Also, also, ugh, here we go. Also, if you played Battlefield 4 on the Xbox 360 and you had premium, I think it's what happens to me. As soon as you get this new update, it basically carries it over because before it never used to happen to me. I, ne I never really had um, my premium. I don't know why I had to buy it again. But as soon as this update came out, it came up and it gave me every single um, battle pack which would come with premium. And I had to unload, unlock loads go through them all one by one press x on unlock all but yeah that is it guys so obviously hop onto battle for four smash that double xp out get some levels ranking up and hopefully you enjoy the update as well as i am at the moment so um yeah if you did like this video please give us a like and also write down in the comments what you think of the update if you've done it and played it and also if you haven't get on it check it out and also hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already to keep get more content from my from my channel myself well obviously from myself because it's my channel but obviously more content like battle for four black ops three stuff like that really so yeah make sure you hit that subscribe button on your way out of leaving my channel okay until next time guys it is Pugin gaming peace <laughs> Tell me that you love me